is because of that exponential mm. uh, growth of the power of these models. I'm not claiming, by the way, that this is the last innovation in AI or this is the last model architecture. Uh, there's going to be lots more to come. But if you look at what has happened between GPT-3 to 3.5 to what comes next, these are not linear, this is not linear progress. Recently, Microsoft decided to invest $10 billion in OpenAI in a deal mainly centered around ChatGPT, the natural language processing application that has illuminated the tech world. This deal will ensure that Microsoft is at the cutting edge of AI technology and can be able to compete with the likes of Google and Apple. Microsoft had already been investing in artificial intelligence for years now, and they have reaped the benefits through various products and services. This chat GPT deal is quite significant when factor in various variables in this argument. Firstly, chat GPT seems to be one of the first reliable chatbot that can do vast array of natural language tasks pretty well. It can write articles and essays on pretty much any topic. It can solve a vast array of computer programming tasks which is now causing skepticism within the software engineer space. Secondly, this tool can be productized within certain industry verticals that will allow a certain level of automation, which can be beneficial to various businesses. Lastly, this technology is only the beginning of a revolution, so to speak in the natural language processing space, and we are only going upwards from here. Microsoft making such an investment in OpenAI shows how serious they are in using this technology to help tackle the various issues they might have in competing with other large tech companies providing adjacent products. One of the main areas where Microsoft might be able to see a lot of benefit from is within the search space. The search space can be seen as winner-takes-all market where one leader gets to call the shots and move the industry forward. The leader in this case would be none other than Google, who has been leading this space for decades now. Due to this lead, like most business companies, inertia has taken over, and experts are suggesting that in the near future, the search market is ripe for disruption. Could Microsoft be the company that can challenge Google's search dominance? Or would it take another incumbent? Even if Microsoft reaps the benefits of ChatGPT and other tools from OpenAI, how beneficial will that be? And how large will the market share be? It is clear that Google is taking the ChatGPT threat seriously. Recently an inside memo was circulating within the company that a drastic restructuring is necessary as the main aim of the company should be focused around artificial intelligence. This shift prompted the company to fire a vast number of engineers who are not needed in this new initiative and keep those who are competent enough to stay. Such a shift in company structure is a clear sign that Google will ramp things up in the AI space. Google does have their own flavor of chat GPT. Although some of their systems are not open source for various reasons, there has been efforts made over the years to make search more conversational, albeit, most of these innovations has been incremental and revolutionary. For its part, Google and its cutting-edge subunit DeepMind have been working on similar systems for years. The search giant chose not to release them to the public, though in part over concerns about unethical behavior and how chat systems sometimes break social norms. For instance, in 2016 Microsoft created a chat bot called Tay that it was forced to take offline after it spewed out hate speech. Even ChatGPT, which has rules to create positive and friendly content, can be manipulated into producing upsetting responses using the right prompts. However, DeepMind CEO Demis Hassabis said in an interview with Time this month, that his company is considering its own chatbot, called Sparrow, for a private beta, sometime in 2023. Google also plans to demonstrate a version of its search engine, with chatbot features as early as this year, according to a New York Times report, citing sources familiar with the matter.
The internet already abounds with ideas for how to put ChatGPT's human-like dialogue to use, from creating custom chat bots, to help fight traffic tickets to creating workout and diet plans. The bigger question, however, is whether ChatGPT, or more accurately, the tech that powers it, will have the same sweeping influence as other breakthrough technologies of our generation, like the iPhone, Google Search and Amazon Alexa. It'll likely be years before we have an answer to that question. But in 2023, artificial intelligence experts expect to see a wave of new products, apps and services powered by the tech behind ChatGPT. It could change the way we interact with customer service chatbots, voice-enabled virtual assistants like Alexa or Siri, search engines and even your email inbox.